you think of income splitting, you're probably thinking of income splitting with a spouse. But did you know that it's possible to split income with your children? The more income you can split with those in a lower tax bracket, the more tax you will save as a family. Today we're going to cover different income splitting strategies with children. Let's get started. Tax savings with minor children. When you give your children money to invest, any income or interest or dividends that's earned on that money will be attributed back to you for tax purposes. However, if the money's invested and earns capital gains instead, well, capital gains will be taxed in the hands of your children, not you. So while a minor cannot open an investment account of their own, you are able to open an investment account for them in what's called an in trust for account and list them as the beneficiary. If you put money into that account and invest it in equity investments, those investments could earn capital gains. Capital gains are taxable, but in this instance, they will be taxed in the hands of the children at their marginal tax rate. Their marginal tax rate will likely be very low or non-existent. Now, one caveat with an interest for account is that you can't just put money in there and then use it for yourself. Really, the purpose of the money in the investments is to benefit the child in some way, whether it be for spending on a major purchase later in life or for education savings, as an example. In trust for accounts are relatively easy and inexpensive to set up. However, keep in mind that when the child reaches age of majority, technically and legally, they now own the money inside of the account. If you want to maintain control of the investments in the account beyond their age of majority, we recommend opening up what's called a formal trust for agreement, which is a little more costly to open up and may require legal guidance. Another example of an income splitting strategy with your children is to open up an RESP or registered education savings plan. With this type of account, you can contribute up to $50,000 and have it invested with the purpose of the proceeds going towards your children's future education. This is another great example of an income splitting strategy because the money will grow tax deferred and when it is withdrawn, only a portion of it will be taxable and the portion that is taxable will be taxed in the hands of your children. It is likely that your children will have a much lower tax rate than you or even a non-existent tax rate at the time of withdrawal. Gifting money to adult children. There is no attribution back to you when you gift after-tax money to your adult children. One way to implement income splitting strategies with your adult children is to help them open up a tax-free savings account or TFSA when they turn 18. If they don't have the money to contribute to it at the time, you can gift them after-tax dollars. That money can then be put into a tax-free savings account and invested and earn income, interest, dividends, capital gains, none of which will be attributed back to you and will grow completely tax sheltered for them. And then of course, when they start entering the workforce and accumulating registered retirement savings plan room, again, you can also gift them after tax dollars, they can put it into the account, save for the future as in a tax sheltered environment. And if you're looking to income split more with your adult children, but they've run out of TFSA and RSP room, you could also consider opening up a non-registered account for them. Again, you can gift them after tax dollars, they can put it into their non-registered account, invest it in equities, mutual funds, ETFs. That money could incur uh, capital gains, dividends, interest, and the money will be taxable at their marginal tax rate. And as long as their tax rate is lower than yours, there's still the benefit of income splitting. So now that you understand some of the opportunities that are available for income splitting with your children, are you interested in exploring further? Our team at Ferguson Financial Planning is dedicated to helping you figure out which options are available to you for income splitting with your children. Feel free to schedule a free consultation with us using the link in our bio. And if you're still looking for more information, check out our article below about income splitting with your children. Thank you for watching.